And if you now go in the prawn suits, we can actually... Thank you. Put the prawn suits in here. Fucking amazing. Can access the upgrade panel. You can recharge it. We can repair it. You can see its name. We can put out the power cells if we want it. We have a prawn suit. Now we also need a modification center in here. Uh, there it is. What is a computer chip and some titanium and a glass. And for the glass I actually need one more crystal. More quartz. Um, there were loads around. The funny thing is, the moment when you're looking for it, you cannot find it. Okay, there we go. I think uh, when I have the resources, I want to make a big tunnel just to go to there. Okay, let's see. Some titanium class and a computer chip. <coughs> May I add two computer chips? So we need two of those, two another two, two of those, and two of those. I mean, the only thing that we need to make is a computer chip. Two times. I forgot of any table coral. What am I? What tool do I miss? The repair tool? No. Oh, the scanner. Okay. Um, table coral. There are still some on this side. I should really start scattering these raw resources as well. But we can do that with the prawn suit as well, so that's actually what I'm waiting on. There's someone under the base. Uh, let's see. So not an access point, by the way. So you can enter the base just by going through here. Some class. Table coral. And another one. Now we don't actually need a modification center over there. Uh, it's not really a deal that we knew need it. But it's nice to have the base completely full and on the roll at least. So there we go. Fully charged. The prawn suits dock. Yes. Now let's actually customize our prawn suit. And let's call it not the prawn suit, but a wolf suit. The wolf suit. Done. Now it's called a wolf suit. Ha. Okay, let's... Um, the base is going to be... Um, red? Should we make it red for now? Or should we make it black on normal? Yeah, let's just make this one black. Let's make the name as the ye golden yellow as we can. Oh, this stairs yellow. And let's make the interior blasting. Ooh, well, hold on. I saw blue. Blue looks cool. I want blue. I mean, we're going to make the stripes red. And this uh, stripes white. I don't know what that stripe is, but whatever. Damn. That's pretty sick, actually. 
the wolf suit. Hell yeah. Now there's... Ooh, the power cells also change colors. Now there's one thing that I come to say. We don't need the Seamoth anymore. At least not for exploring. The only thing that we need this for is going all up and down in this world. Now what we can do is take out the pressure mod. So we have all the defense and everything. And I'm going to put take this one as well. Now it only has the defense system in it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to con give all this stuff from the Seamoth inside the prawn suit. So it's better mechanism and it can go down to 1700 meters. Ladies and gentlemen, we can go to the thermal power plant. And 400 meters below that. So what can we do now? We can make the propulsion cannon. We can make the prawn suit grappling arm. The drill arm and the torpedo arm. Now these, are, as far as I know, these two are the only two that I like. Now these, this, and these two are very incredible. We already have that. Let's see what more we can get. Okay, so we need these two. So we need Kai, Kyanite. And we need advanced wiring kit and a diamond and plaster steel. But this one is more important because we actually could use it to make, um, to get more materials. Now we have to actually have the prawn suit, that is one of the calls done for today. Um, let's actually clean up my inventory real quick and I'm going to do something else. Let's see if I can find the quartz again. There it is. And what we're going to do now is we're going to get an ion crystal and I'll take two just in case and we're actually going to use the um, Seamoth for a moment and we're going over to the other side of the world to the alien facility base the precursor base as many people call it to get the portal up and running. So let's go over there and let's recharge it then. Correct, he shouldn't spawn here anymore. Also, shouldn't go to the front of the ship actually. There it is. Is that it? Yeah, there it is. The big giant cloud. Now, the only thing that we cannot do now is go down so we can actually not see what's underneath us. Well, there's a platform there, but that's touche. Um, so there's a stuff. As far as I can see, I will look down. I'm already at the island, so that's not a problem anymore. So that's the whole tunnel system. There was, like we saw, there were more tunnels than I thought it would be. Now there are two items that we're going to get from here. 
Although also the prawn suit is almost nothing without the uh, submarine. You can use it, but with the submarine is just a beautiful thing. It can go anywhere you want. Um, so we're at the side of this alien base. So you hit that stupid thing. Stupid fish. I can actually scan you for now. Ha! Okay. Now the problem is we don't have our flashlight again. Oh, it's a seagull. Seagulls look weird, by the way. Okay. Uh, we're going to get some lithium. Our coal, that's our coals. I'm going to tell our coals. We get some lot of lithium. Uh, because our inventory is almost empty. And we're going to power up the alien portal on this island. Now, I want to show you once time, um, and I don't know if i already shown you it, but I went the wrong way. <coughs> because I'm a fucking moron. And I told you expressly something wrong. Uh, to find it, you should follow the lights. I told you. And I was almost correct. But I didn't follow the light. No biters yet. No cave spiders at least. What you also have to follow is these... Hey, there's an artifact up top there. These um, cables. Now I actually want to see if I can get to that artifact. There it is. That's mine. Okay, that brings us out of the side of the cave. But there is lithium here. Oh, that's cold, so we don't want it, actually. So always follow this cable. Uh, see the cables going... Because that's actually connected to the alien base. That's the reason why I'm following this. Now, last time I went down here. Now, we actually had to go up here. And we would have found it. <laughs> At least as far as I know the last time. So. I'm a fucking idiot. Was that? No. It wasn't. Now here we are. We actually have the alien facility. Uh, the a first alien portal that we have for going to power up. I'm actually going to look around real quick. I don't thought there was anything else in this place. It was worth exploring, no. So yeah, let's power up this this portal. This is the first portal that we actually going to power up, weirdly enough. So here we go. That's how easy it is. And it will stay on forever now. So let's go inside and look what's on the other side. Now there's an animation for entering the portals as well now. And we will end up... Here. Now, this... Is weirder to find than what we have found now. And we're still on an island, by the way. And in a cave. But this one is much... This one is one that we didn't find yet. So let's see what we found, actually. So if you go on top of here, you'll see an entrance. Just around here. 
And if you remember this little hole, you will notice that we are on the second island. Or the first island that we ever looked at. The home island. I knew there was somewhere in this hole. Actually, we weren't far off, actually. Can I make something that will suit my... That I was here. I just had some titanium I could. Um, if I had some titanium, I actually could make something to lo locate that I was here. So yeah, we have made a portal to the second island. Like you can see, there's the, what the first island where we have our seam off, and now we can actually use this portal to get over to this island. Is there any use to it? As far as I know, no, there isn't. Caution. Dehydration yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll go back. <laughs> 